so what I have here um, is a different box and this one is a little bit bigger as you can see because I got a few of this disc and I'm going to show you a disc real quick and then you're going to tell me what you think the disc in this box is. Let me know in the comments below right now uh, if you can tell what disc is going to be in this box. So, that's that disc. And now we're going to open up this box and see what we have today. If I could open it successfully, that'd be really nice. Throw that over there. So what we have are three of Discmania's new CD3s. I got two blue and a purple. And so the reason I got three of them is because I wanted to have extras for when I uh, inevitably either lose a disc or beat it into a point where it's no longer flying the way I want it to. And so it looks like we got a 175, 173, and 174. To me, I think those couple of grams might make a difference for some people, but for me I don't think they will. Um, but just as a comparison, those are the two different discs between old DD3, new DD3. Let's see if we can't focus. No? Okay, so that's pretty much it. And I like the DD3 for all of my distance shots. Um, I find it very reliable. I currently throw an old Innova Run S-Line. Uh, if you watched the video of me throwing distance drivers before, that yellow one's my primary driver. Very comfortable for me to throw, great grip, and I just like ripping on it. Um, so, if you did pick up one of the new DD3s, I'm curious to see how they fly. So, uh, let me know how you think they fly compared to the old ones if you've thrown both. And also, let me know in the comments below if you want me to make a video kind of comparing the old versus new and see exactly what the differences are. I've read that the new ones seem to be a little bit less stable, so I guess I'm going to have to see for myself whether they are or not. So, as always, don't forget to like and subscribe. Catch you on the next video.